I have a beaker full of water that is boiling. We have a wire gaze and a candle which is heating the water. What do you think will happen when I bring this steel plate on top of the water vapor, on top of the water that is that is boiling? Why don't you predict that? Why don't you take five seconds and think what will happen if I bring this steel plate right at this near near the top of the beaker right over here? Okay, let's see. So I'm keeping the steel plate very close, very close to the top of the beaker. Well, I see something happening. I see, I see these water droplets being formed on the steel plate. Why is that happening? Well, it turns out the water that is boiling, you see these, you see the water vapor rising, right? When it comes into contact with something cool like a steel plate, the water vapor starts changing into water droplets. And that is the process of condensation, the process of vapor changing into liquid. So there you go. You can see condensation in front of you and you can even see condensation in you know, everyday life. Just have a glass full of cold water and when you just let it sit for some time, you can see those water droplets being formed around the glass. That is also condensation. And where did these droplets come from? Well, the air around the cold glass, it also has some water vapor. And when that water vapor comes into contact with this cool glass, it starts condensing. That is, it starts changing back to liquid form. And that is why you see those water droplets.